Hey guys, this is Lily from Good Team. Uh, I'm gonna be showing you how to create an email template uh, in HubSpot. So you'll go to marketing, then click email, and it'll take you to this page. Um, you'll click create email. You'll see these three different options for an email type, uh, regular, automated, and blog RSS. Um, Regular is for like one-time emails that you need to send. Uh, automated emails are for like um, few emails you could put in a workflow um, based on certain trigger responses. So if somebody like clicks a button or a link on your website, then uh, you can add an email that will automatically send to them. Uh, the blog and RSS is you can publish your content once and send updates to your email subscribers. Uh, so we're going to choose a regular email template um, and there within HubSpot are all these different kinds of templates that you can use. These are like basic templates that just have the the bare bones of the elements that you need for these kind of emails. And then there are these more fancy emails down here um, for all different kinds of types of uh, emails. Um, so pick one, click on it. Um, and this format's really similar to like landing pages that you can create in HubSpot. Um, all of the elements are right over here. You can drag and drop into the template. Um, so you can select an image or um, drag and drop images from your desktop straight into the template. Or you can also go over here and do the same, upload and browse images. Um, then you can undo and redo. Um, yeah, and drag and drop any of these. You can choose a layout, a save section if you want to um, save time and have a specific section saved. Uh, then when you're done with all of this um, and you've edited the text that you want and the way that you want it, you've added whatever over here, um, you can go to design. And template design, you can choose your background color. Um, if you have a certain brand colors um, you can go over here and make your brand um, by clicking this and you can set colors and fonts um, and then they will move over here so you can select from those um, brand options here um, or you can reset to default um, advanced options as well right here uh, select a pattern a body color, plain text, full width. You can select a border if you want one. Um, you can do text styles, colors, button options. You can add dividers, all that good stuff. Um, so when you have your template like you want it, you go to settings, um, choose who it's from, um, the email address that it's from. You can add a subject line and preview text here. Uh, internal name, all that. And then once that's ready, you can send or schedule it, uh, select who you want to send it to or select who you don't want to send it to. So say you have, um, like you want to send a discount to new visitors on your websites. So you could um, choose old visitors, uh, returning visitors, don't send this email to them. Uh, that's what you use this for can send it or schedule it for later. Um, and here's what that looks like. And then when you're done with all of that, you can select an automation if you want to, to add it into a workflow. Um, send a test email, can preview it, all that good stuff. Uh, and then when you're done and ready, click review and schedule and see all those settings right here. Um, yeah, and then you would click schedule once all the required fields are met. And that is how you create an email template in HubSpot.